no pedestrians, no parking, swimming, surfing, bikes or vehicles. That's the message from Half Moon Bay. People have been coming to the beach and have not been social distancing. And it's been um, kind of scary, the volume of people coming over here. Lisa Zadek, who lives in Half Moon Bay, says she was relieved to learn that her city is closing its beaches. We've been you know, following the cases on the coast and we've been pretty lucky, but we did have one person that did pass away over here and you know, it's, it's everywhere, so you just want to be as safe as possible. Half Moon Bay Visitors Bureau tweeted, quote, the difficult decision to close area beaches over the 4th of July holiday weekend, effective as of this morning. Governor Gavin Newsom is not mandating any beach closures for the 4th of July weekend here in the Bay Area, but the cities of Half Moon Bay and Pacifica went the extra step to close in an effort to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Pacifica's mayor addressed the issue on Wednesday. We traditionally allow fireworks in our parking lots and our beaches, and this year we're not. So it's going to be extra difficult. So it makes more sense just to close our, our beaches. That doesn't mean everyone is heeding the warning with people fishing and surfing this morning. I don't particularly like it. Um, I think it's a matter of government control over controlling people. Joel Thompson and his partner were on their usual morning walk. He says the beaches have been open on other holidays and to close now is just politics. For the most part, I think that we're hyper sensationalizing the pandemic in order to get create a, an atmosphere of fear and control over the people. And uh, and that's a political move, if you ask me.